This segment is sponsored in part by Travel South Dakota. So much South Dakota, so little time. Breathtaking scenery, historic landmarks, world-class culinary experiences, and some of the most welcoming people anywhere. That's right. We are taking a road trip to South Dakota with some help from our guest, James Hagen from Travel South Dakota. Welcome, sir. You're the man Thank of the you. hour. Thank you. It's good to be here. It's good to be in the Big this Apple, is... and thanks for having us on. Of oh, course. this is a treat for us. I mean, we have flowers, we have macarons, we have bourbon. Breakfast bourbon. I mean, yeah. So, South Dakota. When we think of South yes. Dakota, Thinking more Mount Rushmore. Right. It's a standout. Uh, stands out. Must see experience. Must see bucket list for yeah. everybody. Our, probably our most famous attraction, <laughs> right? Two million visitors a year, but there's so much more to yeah. see besides that. So just in the Black Hills region where Mount Rushmore is, you'll have Crazy Horse Memorial, the largest mountain carving in the world. So you take those four faces of Mount Rushmore, mm -hmm. fit just in the face of Crazy Horse Memorial. They give you a size perspective on that. No way. We have Custer State Park, which is often named the best state park in America, 77,000 acres, the largest publicly held bison herd in America. They round up those bison every uh, every year. The last Friday of September, real cowboys and cowgirls. Oh my right goodness! Yep, yep. Look at this. We've Hold got up. the third and sixth longest caves in in in, a, in the world. So Jewel Cave National Monument, third longest cave in the world. Uh, Wind Cave National Park, the sixth longest cave in the world. Historic Deadwood, home of Calamity Jane, Wild Bill Hickok, uh -uh. Uh, Seth Bullock, uh, you name it. We've got Badlands National Park, which is blown up in popularity. Yeah, okay. It's like stepping in onto Mars. So, right. Yeah. Stepping on Mars. All that, and also South Dakota steeped in history, yeah. uh, which viewers or uh, which visitors can also experience firsthand. Tell us more about Tons that. Tons of history. So again, alluding back to Deadwood, right. uh, the Gold Rush days, 1876. Oh, so you got Calamity Jane, Wild Bill Hickok. Uh, uh, so that rodeos, yeah. cowboys, pioneer history, yes, but most importantly, Native American sure. history and culture, which is just so beautiful. And so we mm -hmm. have nine tribal nations in South Dakota. So every summer, beautiful powwows, lots of pomp and yeah. pageantry. All the things. All the things. I yeah. love just watching you I know, talk you're about South this. Is, uh, you, you, about you, it. You've <laughs> sold it. You've sold it for me. Now, we like a, an adventure. Yes. We've been known to hike. Yeah. Okay. I'm assuming hiking 42nd Street is very different. A little different, <laughs> yes. So I would say a little different because you can actually hike in uh, pine clad forests, uh, pine trees, yeah. mountains, mountain lakes. And actually, we have a trail that's about mm. 130 miles long, runs oh, north wow. to south. It's called the Mickelson Trail. It used to be an old railroad bed. It's been named one of the top 10 bicycling trails in the world. In the world. It was the only uh, trail in. In the in the world or in the United States, yeah. I should say, that was designated one of the top ten. Wow. So there's just so, what if you're into ATV sure. hiking, unbelievable hiking trails, fishing. If you like to spend time on the water, whether that's boating or jet skiing or whatever, swimming. Something for everybody. Just inhaling so, exactly. and exhaling. Okay, I would there say. is so oh, much to do and see in South Dakota as you're describing it. What do I need to put top of my list, though? Top here. Okay, I think something that would really surprise you mm. is actually our culinary scene. So people don't, probably don't think. Okay, South no. Dakota. Just the past two years, we've had two chefs nominated for James Beard Awards. Okay, so that's uh, we that know James Beard. Yeah. yeah. So we have one uh, chef today, Sanaa Aberesk, who runs a Mediterranean restaurant in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, mm -hmm. who is a finalist, and we'll find out soon whether yeah. she wins. Uh, but we also have a, a chef on the western half of the state, uh, uh, Joseph Rainey from Scogin Kitchen. He's been wow. nominated for a James Beard Award as well. And we have a restaurant in the eastern half of the state that just won a James Beard Classic Award. So I think that would surprise you. Great culinary Very scene. Very much. Oh, and I can't forget the macarons. Uh, you, so you came I'm bearing impressed. gifts. I came bearing gifts. Can we so let me, tell us about yeah, it? Yeah, so, we'll so the macarons we, uh, is from CH Patisserie in Sioux Falls, Chris Hanmer. Season two winner of Bravo TV's Top Chefs, just top desserts. Chef. Hold up. He has been named one of the top ten French pastry chefs in America, and we have him in South Dakota. He was on the world mm. gold medal uh, team that won the world championship uh, for pastries, beat the French, um, which was awesome. So his macaroons. I'm gonna tell you something right now. Amazing. I just I came back right from now. Paris. Okay. This is better than what I had in Paris. I say that I have been to Paris. <laughs> yes. When I'm in Paris and I have macarons there. These are the best I've had mm, in the world. South Dakota, it's like they know what they're doing out there. And <laughs> bourbon. And bourbon. Uh, Wash so it down with some bourbon. Breakfast bourbon. bourbon. So you guys, seven Cheers. generations of, of contraband distillery in Ooh. Rapid City. El Capone actually oh. served this bourbon at a wedding in Chicago. He was a big fan. And him. so it's a, it's a bourbon liqueur, very smooth, mm. good for breakfast. 
Oh, that's nice and smooth. Good for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice. It is. It's like got a nice little bit of sweetness. Right? Yes. This is very, exactly. very this smooth. Is sippable. Sir, we knew that South Dakota had national parks and hiking. No idea there were so many different things to taste right. and see. Yeah. Uh, really you've truly. truly opened our minds yeah. to something new. We Thank need to you. get you out there, you two. I think it's time for us to go. Let's go. Think? Pack your bags. Okay. Will you join us? I will join you. He needs to be our I, tour I be, guide. Are you kidding tour me? Guide. I'm not coming unless it. he's Absolutely. showing up to pick You've us up it. from the airport. Fantastic. Okay. I'll Thank be. you so much for your time. Thanks for having me on. I Thank appreciate you. it. I know what we're doing this summer. I love this. I want to see a real cowboy. If you want to learn more about visiting South Dakota, scan the QR code on your screen. You can also visit pix11.com and click on the Pix Partner tab. South Dakota. I love it. Who knew? I could use a little bit of that wide open. Me too.